So, uh, a lot of you have been speculating on what the challenge is. Uh, I think somebody got the uh, understanding correct. Uh, it's not a traditional boss rush, because doing that would require mods, because Rocksteady does not know how to implement a boss rush, and that makes me sad. But uh, this boss rush is a challenge boss rush. So what that essentially means is that I'm just going to play through the game like normal, but for every single boss, I am going to implement a different challenge. Yeah, I'm just going to make the game unnecessarily harder at specific points. For the most part, it's just going to be a regular playthrough, but when those bosses come up, it's going to be really hard. Because I've thought of a different random thing to do for each of them. Uh, similar bosses, or rather bosses that are like the same uh, fight essentially, will have the same challenge. So, like, for instance, each of the Scarecrow sections will have the same challenge. Uh, each of the Titans will have the same challenge, but all the unique ones, those will be their own challenge. Yes, Croc will count. I'm not going to say what any of the challenges are until we get to them. So, just wait patiently, and you will understand the challenge then. I think we're just about ready to go. Let us get this started. After I make a new save file. And I am going to be leaving subtitles off for a very specific reason that you will find out later. I know I'd always play with subtitles, but for once, I am not going to. And I'm also going to be playing on hard mode because uh, I, w I want the pain. <laughs> I enjoy pain and suffering to a small extent, and this is one case where it will have to be there. As always, I'm going to be skipping cutscenes, but uh, we do have to go through the initial walking simulator, so enjoy that, folks. One hour later. What say I just blow the emergency brakes and drop you like a sack of puppies? Say goodnight, bats. <laughs> Only kidding. And jump scare. Alright, so. It is time for our first boss challenge. I'm gonna get into position before we actually get started. So. We're going to be doing Scarecrow. And, for the record, all of the Scarecrow sections blindfolded. I am. <laughs> this is not going to go well at all, but I'm hoping that I remember these sections enough to be able to do them. Yeah, <laughs> I, I know, I'm screwed. So, just, I guess, as proof that I this is... A, this is a real blindfold. This is completely solid. There is absolutely no way I'm seeing through this. This is supposed to be like earmuffs or something. I don't know what it's actually for. But, uh, yeah. This is not going to work. I'm going to die many times. Probably. <laughs> but I am going to keep my headphones in. So I am going to be able to hear the game. So... Theoretically, I should be able to get through it. This is going to be awkward to do because I don't want it to cover my ears. Okay, I'm going to switch back to gameplay so that I don't forget to after the fact. Because <laughs> if I did, that would be very unfortunate. Okay, so my eyes are covered. So hopefully you all believe me. Okay, it's not great. I'm going to have to turn it up a little bit. But since it's a side-scroller, I should be able to get through this. Yeah, the problem is that I already don't know where I am. I don't hear myself dropping is the problem. Choose it. 
to be. idea where I am. I can't. Okay. Okay, I died, so I got to the next part then. totally lost. This is a very stupid idea. I don't think this is gonna work at all. Let you guys try to guide me through. I'm gonna do this, if I can find it. So, in this case, I won't, do, I won't be blindfolded. I will just turn off my screen and move my Streamlabs so that I can't see. I've turned off my monitor and uh, I will show you guys this so that you believe me. I minimize the screen and I move this over here so I can still hear but I cannot see I'm gonna pick up my camera if I can move it correctly see uh, uh, see my screen that's my chat screen there's you guys and there's my other screen where I have absolutely nothing it's totally blank but you guys should still be able to see things Am I correct? So, I'm not gonna peek, I'm not gonna cheat, but you guys are going to tell me where I am. You're not gonna tell me where Scarecrow is, because I know where he is. At the start, okay. I'll wait for Scarecrow to come back around. Okay, am I on the stairs now? Because I'm pretty sure it's stairs. There are no checkpoints in Scarecrow 1? Okay, that's good to know. At the corner. So, top of the stairs at the corner right now. Okay, I'm going to wait for him to come around. Drop, then crouch. I don't know where I'm dropping and I can't hear it. I'm on the edge? Okay. I think I heard him fall. So, there should be another half wall just in front of me, right? A decent bit far, so if I run for, like, two seconds and then crouch, I'm safe, right? Okay. I'm at the second now, right? Jump in front of you. Okay. There we go. Okay. I lost myself. Damn it. Damn it, I lost myself. Shit. We made it far, though. We made it far. The end of fear. Oblivion. Did we make it to a checkpoint, or are there no checkpoints in Scarecrow 1? Max Star, damn it. Okay. Okay, I'm dropped. Should be behind the half wall. Now I run. And... Look around. These are the broken fragments of your mind. Shit! Did I not go far enough? Okay, I just went too far. Damn it. I need a way to get consistent movement that'll get me a set distance rather than relying on time. So I should start doing dive rolls. 
because if I dive, I'm going a set distance every time. Are you scared that <laughs> no, I don't need my mommy. I'm gonna go for three after he comes around. Okay. I fell? One, two, three. Okay, so we should be behind the second half wall, right? I don't know where I am. Did I jump? I think I heard a jump, but I didn't hear Batman's grunt. Where am I? Am I on the ledge? After I climb up, I need to run for the half cover at the explosive gel wall, right? Up, then right crouch. How far to the right? If I roll, will I be too far, or will that be enough? Okay, he made a pass. That's good. Am I very am I very close to being seen right now? Oh god, I'm Okay, so I'm literally a pixel away from being seen then. I'm going to have to watch this back cuz this is amazing. Damn it. Ah. Oh, I I lost it. Okay. I should be behind half cover, so now... Run and jump. What? What? How did that happen? What? Okay. I'm just gonna go... Alright. What? Was I not on the ship? I thought it was on the shimmy wall, damn it! Okay, I was at the shimmy wall, I was not on it though. Big difference. We're getting there though, we're getting there. We're close. Last time, how did I do this twice? Wait, then hold run right. I'm gonna try to get behind the morgue station. Did I make it? Am I at the explosive gel wall? I hear it right here. Am I behind the explosive gel wall? Okay, this is the hardest part. If I'm at the gel wall, if I, from the gel wall, if I dive backwards, will I be behind cover? Gel should be equipped. I press left, gel should be equipped. One dive will get you into cover? Okay. I'm gonna trust you guys. No! Damn it! Damn it, how far were we? I got the gel on the wall. Okay. We could do this. What? Oop, okay. I wasn't listening. <laughs> Damn it. Damn it! How close was that? Okay, I don't know where I just ended up. 
Oh, shoot. the gel wall, right? I made it! Okay. I'm behind I'm behind cover and gel is on the wall, right? Gel is on the wall. Let it blow. Okay. I'm trusting you guys. This is the hard part. I gotta I have to just feel where Scarecrow is looking. I can't tell where he's looking. I have no idea where he's looking. My controller isn't vibrating. I can't tell where he's looking. He's only on the left for like a second. So I've got to go like as soon as he goes over there. Okay. I made it past him. I made it past him. I'm on the stairs leading up to the bat signal, right? I'm pretty sure he doesn't move anymore after this point. Okay, I'm just going to keep pausing because I'm pretty sure he doesn't move, but I'm not entirely sure. Am I on the stairs now? Forward and win? I'm at the top. Holy shit! We let's go, dude. We freaking did it. That was that was fucking stupid. Why did I agree to do that? With that uh, absolute stupidity out of the way, uh. Let's get back to just playing a game for fun, huh, guys? Alright, so, here we are with Bane. And the challenge for Bane is going to be leaving all of the enemies... Leaving all the enemies. I'm not going to attack any of the enemies during this fight. I can only attack Bane. Which means I'll probably need to use regular batterings instead of quick fires at some points. It's actually pretty good Bane luck, he's not taunting at all. Also, sorry, not Bane, Bone. Help him out, boys. Bane can still attack him. They don't need to be left alive in general. They, I just can't attack them. I can dodge over them and stuff if I have to, but... I cannot attack them at all. So I'm going to be running around a lot. Oi. Ow. But this is why I saved some upgrades. I also can't counter them, for the record, because countering does, in fact, do damage to them. This is where it gets difficult, Phase 3, which is already the hardest. Theoretically, it prioritizes Bane, but it could still hit them. Come on. God, there. Alright, so... This hasn't been very bad, if I'm being honest. It's just playing a little bit different. <laughs> it's kind of funny, honestly. <laughs> Alright, 
Stop taunting, just attack me, Bane. Alright, hopefully they... Oh, they're gonna... Oh, they... That didn't take him out. Okay. Thought that was gonna finish him. Okay, now that's lucky. Okay, well, that was surprisingly easy, honestly. <laughs> I did not expect that to go so well. But... That was technically a challenge. And we did it. First try. <laughs> right, you're Joker's Carnival. And it's very much like Joker's Carnival, you're right. Bone has been defeated. Bone has become boner. I'm sorry. Not sorry. Alright. So, I don't think you can beat this without running. But we are going to try. So I'm going to be using crouching as a substitute for running. And we somehow made that. Because there is no way in hell I'm beating this blind. That is not possible. Oh man, it's cocked. I don't like that. I hate when it's angled wrong. Good start. Alright, please fall correctly this time. Okay, thank you. That's better. Can I pull it closer to me? I can pull it a little bit closer to me. This is stupid, but it's actually kind of working. Yeah, I think I moved it all the way. I, I didn't know you could do that. I just tried it. Because, like, I was... I didn't want to just run and do it again. But yeah, that got it closer. Which means... Okay, that... That was on me. I'm gonna be patient because this is the worst. Alright, we made it. Now, hopefully, we can make it over there in time. Just barely, Jesus. Okay, this is gonna be the closest one because I can't run for the ledge there. Just barely, dude. Jeez. Yeah, that's uh, that's a close one. I have to wait for it. Again, gonna be cutting it very close here. Did we make it? Just barely again, dude. Man. again. Ooh, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to make it up there with just crouching. Please, 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 please. Okay! That was surprisingly possible. GG's. Well, it wasn't easy, Ross, but, uh, it was interesting, so I'll always take that. Alright, uh, we're at the Double Titans, and just so I can have a second to explain, the challenge for this one is uh, no punching. I am not allowed to attack these guys with my fists. So, and just as a bonus thing, I'm also not going to do the back rides. Just as a small bonus challenge. So, I can literally only get these guys with batarangs and maybe them attacking each other. And you see how little damage that does. So, this is going to be awkward. It's going to be slow as hell, <laughs> but it shouldn't be that bad. Explosive Dell does damage them, but more importantly, it progresses them between phases. So, hitting them in the wall does, t does damage them very slowly, but it does damage them. I'm just going to do this while I'm waiting for them to exist again. Ow. Good. 
Max and Nobody, everything is propaganda. And if you think otherwise, you're wrong. Yeah. So that progresses them between phases. So I don't have to punch them at all. The problem is going to be laying it down to actually hit them. And it is how I have to defeat them, because at the end you normally have to punch them. But if you just lay down explosive gel, you can do it that way too. So yeah, this is possible. It's just going to take a while and potentially be hard if I end up getting hit too many times. Okay, you're going to charge two. Not yet. That's bad timing. How the hell did he miss me? You almost always go down to no HP before you die. Excuse me, before you die, so I'm okay. I'm gonna run. Yeah, see? I'm fine. <laughs> okay. Uh, that should be... That's the last hit for him, but I don't... Do I want to do it? I'm going for it. We're gonna do this. And then this, just so that he doesn't accidentally get up. And then this to knock him down. And just like that, one HP in a dream. Easy peasy, living greasy. He is the lesser of two evils, but he's still not great in that regard. Okay, this is actually gonna be really close. That was, yeah, that was a close one. Just because you're a small channel who doesn't get a lot of views doesn't mean you get to take views from big channels. I think reacting to trailers is fine because that's something that the company actually wants you to see and spread around. This is gonna be close. Okay. Like, one way I've seen people get around it for, like, movies and TV shows is uh, if people want to do a watch along, they just have the timestamp of where they are in the movie. Well, after the fiasco that was the beginning of stream, or the Scarecrow 1, Beyond, I'm doing pretty all right. Most of you guessed, uh, we're gonna be doing Killer Croc Death. So, I'm gonna be taking off my headphones, and turning them down so that uh, I will not be able to hear anything. I obviously don't have headphones in. I turned off subtitles so that I can't see if uh, Croc is talking. And I'm just gonna rely on doing this this way. So we will see if this works. I. Uh, It'll probably be really scary, that's why I'm doing it, but, uh, we'll see. Alright, save point, which means he's gonna pop up right here. I am smart. Thankfully, I've done croc enough times to, oh, okay. Know generally where the things are. I can only use my launcher so much, Karen, because it'll only get you so far before Croc decides to pop up. And the problem is that he'll pop up right in front of you sometimes. Like this! Exactly like that, see? Which means that, and it's harder to do because I won't know when he's popping up until he does. Which is scary, because normally I'd be able to hear the audio beforehand. But if, when I can't, it's not good. It's a challenge because I don't know when Croc is going to pop up, Bolty. So, I'm... And there's a chance that he pops up around the corner, and I just don't know that he's there. It also just makes it scary, because, like, I can't... Yeah, see, he jumped up. I didn't know he jumped up. He just popped up in front of me. I just saw the things moving. I had no idea that happened. I almost completely ignored him because he popped up to the side there. <laughs> too close, Crocky boy, too close. 
popping up or no? Yeah, there he is. Aha, I knew it. I knew it. Good start, but now we've got the We're long trek here. back to the Where entrance, the which is the hardest he part. Because it's 300 meters. Right in front of me. I sure do love when that happens. But on hard mode, he just continuously breaks them. As soon as the encounter begins, basically. It's this way. I mean, he just keeps popping up like this, even though I just knocked him down a second ago. So, this was incredibly fast. I knew it! I somehow knew it! I knew he was popping up again. I knew he was popping up again. He just happened to be behind me. Oh my god, that was... Okay, that... Okay, doing this again, sure. Okay, well, we did it. Wasn't too hard, but it was scary. I will give it that. That's really all that mattered. Alright. That was not too bad, if I'm honest. But we take those. I did have to just intuitively know when he said, now, but uh, honestly, that's fine. Oh wait, I don't need to do that, because I'm not doing the attack, whoops. So again, I'm not going to, uh, I'm not going to punch the titan, but I can punch the random enemies. Barely did not hit me. I hit the Titan. Oh yeah, this is skill issue run all over again. I'm gonna die. Damn you. Well, at least he ran into the gates. That was nice. Other superheroes are not that. Okay, damn you. Oop, okay, that's uh, interesting. going kind of well. I hit the fucking ti- God! Mm. I don't know much about Martian Manhunter, but if I'm not mistaken, he's very similar to Superman in terms of power level. So, okay. You know what? We're just gonna go ahead and restart and pretend that didn't happen. You just... Okay, that works. We take those, assuming they don't attack me. Ow. Alright, buddy, just charge so I can start getting this fight over. He's gonna hit me. Damn you, man. Please don't attack me. Alright, they're all down. Now we just gotta finish the rest of this. Alright. Cool. We're finally done with this. Thank God, dude. Friendly reminder, this fight is not hard. It's just annoying as shit. And yeah, just in case you missed it, we're doing Ivy without quick fire. So, uh, both of my fingers are gonna be hurting from this. Oh yeah, everybody, uh, put your headphones in, because we are fighting <laughs> Ivy, so... If you don't have headphones, now is the time. Alright, phase one was very easy. <clears throat> oh, 
Oh, okay, I'm dead. I'm not dead. Got heals. <laughs> Hit that bro in midair. Oh crap. Ah, that was bad. Nice snipe. I'm not dying here. Yeah, if I didn't do that, I was dead. That's what we call reaction time, folks. Is it cheating? Yes. Do I care? No. Nice. Easy. Easy fight, easy life. Okay. Might actually be difficult because. Yeah, I still didn't get it. I'm stupid. Okay. That's a good question. Nobody. I mean, they're only allowed to attack one at a time in this game, so that's part of the reason for sure. Good for you, random thug. I really don't care. There is a little reason, Dallas. It's because he's a party pooper. As the achievement name would say. And final one. Easy. Batman is fucking dead. Alright, reminder, we are not going to be punching the Titans. Okay, screw you, buddy. This is gonna be a long fight because now there's two of them. Okay. Okay, good start, folks. Good start, indeed. There were two Titans before, but, uh... That fight was easy because it was just them. Now there are enemies. And it also took forever, so yeah, this is gonna be a long fight. We just have to wait. There's nothing else I can do. Let's do this. Speed things up at least a little bit. Ow, that's bad luck. Oh, that uh, progressed him. That's good. Can you do a charge? No? Alright, well, I'm just gonna do that. And distract you two for a little bit. Oh, there we go. So it's when I progress both of them. Good to know. But of course we progressed again. Or not. Only one guy? Is that the only guy? No. Hopefully 
hopefully I can get this down in time. Ah, of course I just missed it. Go figure it. Okay. I'm healing. him so that he will be less likely to hit me. So, uh, fun fact, I did not have a plan for Titan Joker. So, uh, yeah, I have no challenge for Titan Joker. This fight is so bare bones and boring that there is nothing I can add to make it interesting. If you guys have something off the top of your heads, go for it and say it, because there's genuinely nothing that you can do in this fight. We'll do no... Excuse me. No countering and no evading. How about that? It'll be a double dip. No countering and no evading. Which means I'll either be taking the damage or beating them to the punch. I don't think anybody has actively said those words about this fight, wizard. Ow. Okay, the hard part is gonna be these guys. Yep. Why did I evade? Why did I do that? This is an easy challenge. It's just natural, man. I'm going against my natural instincts. And now the game is gonna keep telling me to counter, even though I'm not gonna do it. Those gadgets made the thing much easier. What? Where did you come from? Ah, oh, they're coming back. Fantastic. I love that. Everybody cool. We did it. Jesus Christ, that was stupid. Alright, that is that. Uh, this will be a video eventually, not sure when, but at some point or another, we will have a video on this. I think that's all I got. So yeah, thanks for watching, hanging out, that was a long stream. But yeah, I will see you later, chaps.